everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today I have probably the biggest ASOS haul um, I have ever done. Basically I'm going to Ibiza this weekend so when this video goes up I'll have just got back. I didn't really have any like really nice kind of summer beachy pool clothes so I went on ASOS and I was like I'm gonna order a few bits and I ended up just going absolutely mental and ordering so many things and there really is a lot of stuff so if you don't mind I'm just gonna kind of go through things quickly because I know that you guys don't like watching 20 minute long videos or maybe you do but I personally don't so um, here we go. I should probably mention that I've developed like this obsession with stripes and all my life I've been like anti-stripe but I have this recent obsession with stripes as you can see I'm wearing a striped dress now this one I love this one is from unique 21 I will link it in the description box also guys all of the clothes that I'm gonna show as always I will link down below so the first thing I've got is this striped shirt dress and I'm kind of embarrassed because it kind of looks identical to the one that I've got on now um, but the reason I got it is because it's a really gorgeous like lightweight thin silky material and this one's quite thick this is more of like like a city London dress whereas this is more of a holiday dress and also it's got the really gorgeous um, like beige stripes as well not just navy and white and it's really short really cute and I just thought it was very like Saint-Tropez very like elegant summer wear okay so next oh my god there are so many striped things in here I'm so embarrassed but this next thing oh my god I think is one of my favorites and this is so so pretty it's basically like a really short cute fun play suit it's obviously stripes it's kind of got that like sailor girl vibe and there are just so many gorgeous details so the sleeves are kind of like half sleeves the front is like a deep v-neck that um ties like in a bow here at the front and usually i don't like that kind of neckline because i'm not very booby so um sometimes i feel a bit like flat in those necklines but this one is like really really flattering and then the best detail is the little frill on the shorts it's like a really really subtle little detail but kind of just makes the whole thing look so much more finished and expensive so so nice so I went for another kind of like just summer holiday beach dress this again isn't really one that I would wear here at home in England it's really beautiful um white and dark blue embroidered dress and it's kind of got this really lovely like loose fitting top it's like really casual and then it ties here in a bow at the back and then the skirt is attached but the whole back section is cut out so it's just like your bare back so it's kind of like a cohort except it does connect at the waist and I just thought this embroidered pattern was so pretty it reminded me of Greece um like this is what girls in Greece wear and I'm sure it's probably not perfect for summer perfect for just throwing on over a bikini although it is nice enough to double up as like a dress that you would wear to dinner so I got this maxi dress and this is from a brand this is a Matthew Williamson um dress and Matthew Williamson is like a designer and his stuff is really expensive but this really was not expensive at all it's just this really beautiful again really lightweight white fabric and it's embroidered with this incredible like neon kind of corally pink which you know is so not my thing I'm like anti-neon at all times for some reason on this dress it just works and I love it and it's also embroidered with like little beads little mirrors it's a halter neck so it ties here with these cute little tassels and then the back is completely um bare and exposed it's like a summer goddess dress like especially with a tan and just like hair flowing down your back like oh my god just to break it up I'll take a break from clothes and show you a few accessories I got the first is this hat and oh my god I am just beyond obsessed with this hat I'm just gonna put it on for you because to be honest I think it speaks for itself basically just a really like wide brim brown straw hat but it's embroidered with I'm busy and this is so me because when I'm sunbathing I just want to lie there I don't want to talk to anyone so if anyone comes to try and talk to me I'm just going to be like these hats are basically like a kind of not a rip off but a copy of these amazing sun hats and I don't know what designer they are but they're basically these embroidered hats they've kind of started this whole trend and they're like over 300 pounds for a straw hat which like for most of us it's just not gonna happen next I have a pair of sunglasses and oh my god I'm so excited to show you these they are sunglasses from Key Australia which I've talked about in my last haul it's kind of like a relatively new brand but it's so so cool and the sunglasses are amazing and they're like really affordable prices as well they're all about like 
between 30 and 40 pounds so they're not like super cheap but they're not like crazy designer expensive prices either but I got these ones and I've wanted them for so long and they're the cherry bomb rose gold I think the cherry bomb rose gold sunglasses and here they are they are just so so pretty they are quite oversized um, and they kind of have like a slight cat eye shape which you know I really really love and they have like the reflective um, lens and it's kind of like a rainbow it's very pink but there's also like a bit of blue in there a bit green and the frame is rose gold of course and I just think they look so amazing I'm gonna put them on I need to plug my laptop in. my laptop is gonna die don't die no one likes things to die I'm sure you're all very proud of me that apart from the sunglasses I haven't bought a single pink thing so this dress is another maxi dress and this is a really pretty thin linen maxi dress it's basically the ultimate beach dress it's just got that really thin basically see-through linen material which is absolutely acceptable on the beach and I just thought it was so like nautical very like French Riviera kind of style really classic kind of like off-duty film style kind of maxi dress you know like an old Hollywood movie style like if they were going to the beach like Bridget Bardot or Audrey like they would wear something like this I don't know it would have to be the Tiffany cat eyes can you imagine this and these sunglasses on the beach like with a vanilla ice cream just like oh my god it's just so Audrey I can't cope this is another one that's like fulfilling my Greek fantasy and it's this really cute another white and blue embroidered dress. I'm aware they look exactly the same and maybe I won't keep both but let's be honest I probably will. I love this one even more than the other because this basically has like a high neck and it is totally backless. Oh it's just like the perfect dress for on holiday this one is also quite linen-y like it's another 100% cotton dress so it feels really really nice and I just think this is like a really young carefree summer dress but still really sophisticated like really pretty and the final dress is this one and it's so so pretty it's very nautical very kind of sailory it's got the double strap which is just one of my favorite things ever for summer the shoulder strap and then the off shoulder strap and then it's got this flappy collar at the front which is just so like sailory it's like the kind of it reminds me of like sound of music you know when they have their sailor outfits I love the black and white the black stripes are really really thin and they're actually like beaded stripes as well so they're tiny little circles and it's just a really cute detail it almost looks like it's been stitched that way so that's all of the clothes but now I have a bag and a few pairs of sandals to show you as well so I got this bag and it made me laugh actually because I was doing my ASOS order and I was like buying all of the stripes and the blue and white Ooh. oh oh and I was thinking of the whole like French thing and I was kind of getting into the theme and then I was looking for a beach bag because I just really want a nice beach bag to take away with me to Ibiza and then I saw this one and I was like oh my god that just like completes my whole theme and it's this bag and they actually had two they had um saint pay and can but the saint pay bag i just preferred the colors i think this was originally 65 pounds and it was on sale for 25 and i think this is like the nicest most sophisticated beach bag i have ever seen and it's actually amazing because it's actually got five internal pockets and honestly i just thought this completes like my whole haul like my whole summer style this is just like oh my favorite thing in the world right now i say it every um, I thought that was it but then I forgot that I actually bought two swimming costumes as well. I got this swimsuit and provided it looks good on like this is the one that I'm going to be taking away with me for this weekend and it's this one by a brand called oh no it's ASOS. It's so cool because it's a swimsuit but it's still like really revealing it's not too like covered up and then I also got this one and it's just like a really cute white crochet swimsuit. It's a halter neck it's just like a really standard swimsuit shape but I just thought the crochet was really pretty again it was kind of a bit French then finally I have a few pairs of sandals and I will go through these quite quickly because I'm sure this video is already very long um the first ones are these sandals from Faith these are just some really like simple easy to wear sandals they have this really gorgeous like nudie pink suede scalloped um straps these will literally go with everything because they're nude and they're just really easy to wear and simple and cute so i just thought why not then i've got these ones which are asos own brand getting a bit more daring um but they're these sandals that have this really cute like canvas um embroidered flowers on the back and then they have these like leather um 
straps that you basically like wrap around your legs like a bit like ballet shoes and this is like a trend that is so so big right now and um, everyone's like lacing up their legs basically but these are quite subtle so if you're like me you don't like to do anything that's like too daring or out there um, then this is quite a nice way to break you in and then the last pair of shoes and also the most daring are these ones also from ASOS and they're called the fairy tie leg sandals and these have been in my saved items for ages and I've just been like oh shall I I don't know and then I thought yes and these are the ones that literally lace up like all the way up your leg so these are like quite bold but also at the same time they're nude, they're leather so they're still very classic and like minimal at the same time. But these are so pretty because they literally remind me of like my old ballet shoes. I just think they look so cool, they're so like 2016. <laughs> So we're finally at the end. That's everything that I ordered from ASOS this time and I hope I've given you some summer inspiration. Let me know which your favourite bits were in the comment section or if you've seen anything on ASOS that you think I would love and I should get next time. Make sure you guys follow me on Twitter at Freddie My Love with two E's and also Instagram at Freddie Cousin Brown. You guys can also add me on Snapchat, which is Freddie My Love with two E's, the same as my Twitter. Snapchat is my favourite form of social media right now. I basically like daily vlog on Snapchat every day. If you like the video, please do give it a thumbs up and if you're new to my channel and you would like to see more videos like this every Monday at 7 then please subscribe to my channel. I hope you all had a lovely weekend, have an amazing week ahead and as always I will see you next Monday in my video. Bye!